Hey, Michael Church, Crawl Space Ninja. Today, I'm going to talk to you about air duct cleaning and uh, answer some frequently asked questions that we get a lot about air duct cleaning. So I hope this video is helpful. Stay tuned. Okay, so there's a lot of information out there about air duct cleaning, and I'm gonna cover quite a bit of that today, but uh, one of the things that I wanna mention is, uh, before we get into this, is that at the end of the video, we're gonna be giving away our uh, humidity reader this month, so uh, I've got a question at the end of the video that I want you to take a look at, subscribe to our channel, answer the question down below in the comments, and you'll be entered to win one of our indoor humidity readers. Uh, high humidity in a home is is bad. Uh, it creates mold problems, dust mite problems, and things like that, especially if you're talking about air duct cleaning. Imagine if you've got an air duct full of dust and then you've got high humidity uh, in the house and that air duct, uh, the dust in that duct can grow mold and can also be dust mite colony uh, uh, food sources and things like that, which is why this topic is so important. So uh, let's get into this. Uh, uh, first, I wanted to give you a little bit about uh, us. We've been in business 15 years. If you've never heard of Crawl Space Ninja before, um, we operate under Crawl Space Ninja and Basement Ninja. We focus on uh, crawl space encapsulation, uh, basement waterproofing, attic uh, insulation and air sealing, as well as duct cleaning and air sealing. So that's uh, all of those things relate to uh, indoor air quality. So fixing indoor air quality problems across the country is our number one priority, whether uh, you're wanting to do it yourself or you want to be part of our family through our franchise uh, business opportunity or perhaps a branch manager or a salesperson in one of our territories that we're either moving to or currently in. So if you want to see uh, where we are right now, be sure to check out crawlspaceninja.com. If you're a homeowner needing a quote, uh, we can certainly do that, uh, but also we're looking for great people to expand our, our company so we can help more people across the country. Okay, so how often should I get my ducks cleaned? Now, uh, this is a pretty standard answer across the internet. They say about every three to five years minimum, uh, but uh, you know, if your ducts are sealed well, you don't have to get them cleaned as often. If you use a great filter, you don't have to get them as cleaned as often. Uh, if you change your filter regularly, you don't have to get them as cleaned as often. But uh, some of the things that may actually make it more uh, uh, time-wise getting your filter, your ducts cleaned more rapidly or more often would be if you live in an older home. If you live in a house that's uh, uh, got a lot of drafts and allows a lot of outdoor air into the home. If you got a, a leaky uh, attic that's not air sealed, if you live on a gravel road, believe it or not, that's uh, something that can cause problems. If you have pets, uh, especially birds uh, and guinea pigs and cats and, and things that shed or have dander, those uh, those can be problems for people. Um, if you have a respiratory problem, perhaps a COPD sufferer, if you're a smoker, if you have a lot of allergies, um, or you just have a, a regular problem with dust, uh, carpeted homes tend to uh, uh, hold more dust than uh, 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 homes with uh, hard floors or, or tile or things like that. Certain parts of the country, whether you keep your home closed up more often, uh, trying to condition that air versus living in a part of the country where you keep your windows open more often. Those are all factors in whether you should get your air ducts cleaned more often. Okay, so signs I need my ducts cleaned. Uh, obviously dust, that's a huge sign. Um, if you're changing your filters a lot and they have a lot of dust, that's a huge sign. Um, if you uh, see dust coming around the registers, um, that, that could be a, an indication that you have a huge dust problem. If you're uh, susceptible to allergy problems, you're taking a lot of allergy medicines, perhaps even getting shots and things like that. If you have some kind of respiratory comfort, if you walk into your house, your house is your sanctuary. If you walk into your house and you feel worse being inside of the house than you do maybe at work or at school or outside, you know, that could be an indication of not only a, a duct 
uh, dirty ducts, but you could have other air quality issues, uh, uh, VOCs or mold problems or things like that. So just remember, you're supposed to feel better in your home than you are other places. You spend more time inside your house typically than you do any other place uh, uh, out in the world, uh, especially in your bedroom. I mean, if you're if you're getting your eight hours of sleep, your bedroom is going to be uh, your biggest sanctuary room in the house or wherever you may sleep. Can flex ducts be cleaned? We get this question asked a lot. Uh, we do have special equipment with soft brushes that is able to clean flex ductwork, believe it or not. Uh, most companies uh, don't use this type of technology and they can uh, damage ductwork. Is it foolproof that uh, you can never damage ductwork with flex uh, duct uh, brushes? No, you can you can have an old brittle uh, ductwork that's that's been around since the build of the house and you built your house in the 70s and of course it could get damaged. But for the most part, we have the ability to uh, take care of those damaged ducts. And one of the things we encourage you to do if you're uh, serious about about your air quality is not only to get the ducts cleaned, but to get them sealed. The nice thing about that is you can get the ducts cleaned and get them sealed. Chances are you may not have to have the ducts cleaned at all, uh, especially not as often. And if there is a puncture or a small cut in your flex ductwork, our sealing capability with the Aero Seal is going to be able to seal that as part of the duct cleaning. Okay, so other ways to improve your air quality. I mentioned this before, but I feel like this needs to be addressed. You wanna seal the ductwork, make sure that it's done properly. You wanna use great furnace filters, and then you wanna change those filters often. Uh, if you're using a disposable filter, you wanna maybe change it every 30 days. If you got a real dusty house, every 90 days if you don't. Uh, change, uh, uh, use an air purification technology that ionizes the air. Now that's important uh, because ionization is the ability to clump dust uh, particles together to make them larger so that filtration can capture more particles. It also makes them heavy enough to drop out of your breathing zone so that you can get them off of the floor, either through vacuuming or some other ways of cleaning the floor. Uh, and then of course you wanna air seal your crawl space, make sure it's encapsulated, humidity is controlled, your unfinished basements, things like that, as well as air seal your attic because a lot of what's in the attic is going to come down uh, inside of the house if it's not properly air sealed. And then of course, if your ductwork is running through your attic or your crawl space and they are dirty uh, and they're not sealed properly, they're gonna pick up more of that dust that we talked about earlier. Okay, so the big question, how much does it cost to get your ducts cleaned? We find reputable companies that are not Joe pick em up truck companies that actually have offices and overhead and you know pay their employees well and carry proper insurance and advertise and do all those things and are going to be around in five years uh, you know because the average company closes uh, what is it 96 percent of companies close their first two years uh, you're going to look to spend between 700 and a thousand dollars per system now this does uh, factor in on how many uh, returns or supplies are on that system. So if you've got a system that's got 20 uh, registers and four returns, it's going to be more uh, because it takes time to clean all those. But uh, prices will vary depending on registers and returns. Also, be aware of these scam artists. There's lots of people advertising in Groupons and, and in your local mailer books and things that says $49 duck cleaning and all that. Well, you know, that's called the old bait and switch. They're just trying to get in your house and make sure you check these companies out by reading their reviews. If they don't have reviews, then that's probably a sign that you should stay away from them. Whether you use Angie's List to review them or Yelp or Google or whatever it is, make sure you check out all the companies you hire. We primarily use Google as a way to uh, keep ourselves honest and we've got uh, over 230 reviews on Google. Many are five star, if not most are five star. We got one one star, but you can see what that was all about. I'm not going to explain that, uh, but check out that one star review we've got here in Tennessee. Uh, but anyway, 
anyway, don't trust those companies that don't have an online presence or perhaps they're using a PO box uh, in order to do business. You want to make sure they're in a office or a warehouse. Our, our All of our locations have offices. They uh, may not be manned uh, or, or uh, may not have people at them all the time. Uh, depending on the location, but you can certainly call up that office and visit the office and make an appointment to come and see the operation if you want to do that to feel comfortable when you hire a Crawl Space Ninja Basement Ninja to clean your ducts or seal your ductwork. All right, this is my last slide here. I just want to talk about some of the benefits of air duct cleaning and show you some of these before and afters. We use the Air Care duct cleaning system it's a it's a freestanding system that we can a uh, portable system that we can take into any building commercial or residential the air care system is great because it's a hepa vacuum system along with a soft brush system so that we can clean flex duct or hard duct so some of the things that it removes is uh, if you've got dead things inside your duct work you want to make sure you get those things out uh, we're also going to remove irritants and allergens and years and years of dust buildup uh, it does improve uh, your living space and make the air cleaner inside the home as well as give you peace of mind and control odors as well so uh, we can also do what's called a disinfection of the duct work using our Anabec product so uh, if you got any questions about any of those things I want to make sure you give us a call I'm going to put a link down below uh, to our website but of course you can call us uh, anytime at 865-659-0390. And my name is Michael Church with Crawl Space Ninja and Basement Ninja. If you got any questions about getting your ducks cleaned or sealed, we hope you'll contact us. And oh, by the way, here's the question you want to answer. If you want to take a look, wait, wrong way. It's over here. Make sure you take a look at this question and uh, answer the question down below. Like our, uh, our, our, or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like this video down below as well. And we'll get you entered to win uh, that uh, humidity reader. My name is Michael Church with Crawl Space Ninja and Basement Ninja. We hope you make it a happy and blessed day. We'll see you later.